Hello everybody, um, welcome to Dark Elf skin number three, Team Positivity. This could be a starting Dark Elf team, looks like it. So we are missing a block, but we have a dodge um, and an apple. So that's all right, isn't it? It looked like it could be really, really problematic the next game with two journeymen and uh, missing the witch, but this is about as good a game as we could have got, I think, actually. Positive. The power of positivity there, paying off. We're actually getting a, one of the better matchups possible. Oh. Um, Woody's won a uh, random boy in an insane match. Insane match. <laughs> That's crazy squirrel dude, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, and runner is actually alright for this matchup, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Oh the the runner's not a bad player. It's just that you know, he's he's a weak link, which can be targeted. And uh and he takes star player points away from your blitzes, so I just don't. I don't like him in progression. I think he's. I think he's fine in a naff style, or you know, some other kind of style, whatever it would be. Um, if you may, like the, the one that we had. What was it called? Uh, the cross platform cup. If for some reason you went with dark elves in that, I think uh, having a runner there would be fine. No, oh, sad times, squirrel dude. Well, we'll see Kiwi Nutsack attack. I mean, he's gonna, he's gonna, um, well, uh, Valenic, I tell you what, Pete W takes a runner and doesn't even take leader on him, he just puts dodge on him. So, you don't even have to take leader on him as well. So, um, yeah, the playoff match is gonna be interesting. Uh, you know, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough because his war dance, you know, my guy doesn't have... If my guy had block, I'd be a lot more confident. But, um... But... You know, it's it's obviously scary. His war dances are 75% knockdowns instead of 55. It's not that big a deal, but it just makes me feel like, you know, I'm completely... Oh, well, ball carry is completely unprotected, which is uh, pretty scary. So this is, this is pretty bad because normally I'd have a witch elf... And I'd have three block guys, wouldn't I? And the, the the witch elf would carry. And I would have three block guys. Oh my god, I could just surf this guy as well if I had a witch elf. He probably wouldn't have set up like this. And I could bits him to there and then three plus to surf him, but I don't think so. He doesn't have a witch elf, so that's something to remember. Um, yeah. Bit disappointing that I don't get to... Uh, I only get two safe blocks. So like I'm taking a block out on my offense because I think it's worth having the ball carrier with Blodge really. Um, you know, he's he's dark elves, he can he can probably get a hit. Um you know, he can probably oh god. He can probably roll some dice and get a hit off uh on the ball carrier at some point. So I wanna carry with a dodge guy. Um yeah, not on progression, yeah. Three plus dodge. Yeah, exactly, yeah, I could blitz him. I could blitz him like that. And then, yeah, three plus dodge. And then surf him. But, what would happen would be, I would fail the three plus dodge, reroll would be gone, and that's not good, is it? Jimmy's book of no surfs says, don't do it. <laughs> oh, shit. Bad day for Senai. At work. She's got to do... Well... Hard work. Thou shalt not surf. Exactly. Exactly. It's... Uh, so how, is, this good, is this good enough against um, a Blitz? This is probably better against a Blitz, isn't it? Right. 
No, I could have set up for the... Yeah, so I probably should have set up for the quick snap. And that actually was set up for the quick snap. Until I moved that, because I could have moved in there. If I, if I hadn't moved, if I'd had it set up like that, I could have moved the quick snap there, couldn't I? No, it's still been a 2 plus dodge, though. No, it's been still been a 3 plus dodge. Oh, no, because I could have pushed him to there. Oh, shit. Oh, well, protected the ball. That was the most important thing. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, I, I, actually, I should have thought about the... I didn't think about the quick snaps. So that's my... It's my bad play, I should have thought about the quick snap and then, yeah, I could have gone there, pushed him to here, got another assist in, yeah, and the serve. I would have had to dodge out afterwards, but, oh man, oh man, he should have, I should have punished him. I should have punished him so hard then. Oh, I just didn't, I didn't even think about quick snap. Oh. Oh. I mean, it's good though, because it was still a crap setup, so it's still encouraging for the rest of the match, I think. <laughs> I don't want to follow a god that forbids surfing. Problem is with Crazy Lima is the failure, there's so many failures of going for the surfs and failing them. Is, uh, is not good, is it? I'm still tempted to go for this. <laughs> no, there's no, there's no witch. I, I, I guess I accept the one in nine here. As horrible as it is. Don't have to. Blitz the blitzer, I guess. Oh, this is a bit trickier now. Oh my god, I can't accept this one, can I? Probably shouldn't have done that because I couldn't accept the one in nine there. I realised after I'd let this guy through. But I actually couldn't. So I blocked safe and then I made a risky one. That was, I shouldn't have made the risky blitz, I guess. That was pretty stupid, wasn't it? I should have picked up the ball before making the risky blitz. But specifically moved him over so that wasn't a risky block and then made a risky blitz. Fucking stupid, isn't it? Stupid. Stupid. Stupid play. Fuck. Should not have made that blitz. Should, well, I mean, I should have gone for the pickup and then failed it. That's what I should have done. Ah, the good thing is it was a double score, so even if I'd had a block blitzer, it would have still failed. But, um, yeah, that was disappointing. No. Oh. Did you see what I wrote before? I didn't thought, no, I didn't, sorry. Um, I didn't, no. I'll, I'll scroll up. Oh, hello, Zagini. Uh, four delves. What inducements would you take if you had 620 inducements against a 2090 high elf team with a wizard stadium? Oh my god, Thor. Um, dark elves. Um, wizard. Hubris. Eldro. Yeah. If you can get all that. Oh, you're the high elves. Oh, God. And they're dark elves. Um, then Moranian. Eldro. Wizard. <laughs> you already have the wizard. Moranian. Eldro. Apple babe. Or something like that. Bribe, I don't know how many players you've got. Mm, bribe, maybe. It's a bit horrible, isn't it? Oh 
I doing here? Hope that he gives me a surf because he seems to be new to Blood Bowl. Brings more on, yeah. The stun might give us something. Thirteen players, yeah. You could go, you could go Morg and just beat the shit out of him. Yeah, but I mean, obviously, it wouldn't be. It would just be. It would just be screaming like this, wouldn't he? Um, you know, obviously, he's setting up like this because I don't have frenzy. Presumably, he might be. He might just be awful and might have given me. But he gave us it with a quick snap. I should have set up for the quick snap. <laughs> yeah, random boy. Yeah, hope to base, base, base. <laughs> Yeah, but Hubris is Dark Elves rather than... Um... Oh, he's the one. He's the one who's got the thing. Oh, right. Oh, he's the one that's down TV. Right, right, right. So I read it right. That the High Elves are the higher TV team, but you're the High Elves. Right. So the Dark Elves are the ones that are down TV. So in that case, it, it I would take... I would take then 900 TV, but he gets four loners, right? Um, yeah, in that case, I would take Hubris then and uh, Hubris and Eldril and a wizard. Yeah. Oh, you've already got a wizard. Hubris and Eldril and uh, bribes then. And then just foul with Hubris. Yeah, it's true. You can in Fumble, can't you? Or at least could. Um, <laughs> it was insane, Gwydion, uh, but Drick won in the end. Not Dick. <laughs> um, mm. go a little bit one way don't I so that he feels that he has to respond um, but then obviously not so much that I fuck myself Bit shit giving up a block, but then I'm fucking leaning right in there. I want a massive head, fucking potato head, then. Right. Um. Yeah, a dant rolled a bunch of ones at the end. Uh, they both made some mistakes. Pressure getting to both people, I think. Um. And you know it was it was very scrappy. A Dan maybe pursued the wrong strategy um, in the end, but uh, he won the coin toss in overtime, wow. and then rolled a bunch of ones and got banged on. So he's just letting me surf at this point, isn't he? 
who Brazil will bribe be. Yeah, fair enough. Yep. Seems a decent choice, if you ask me. So maybe he is a bit new. Do you know, know what I can do? Why am I guessing about how good he is? I can just find out. He's new. Five, four, six. New to Blood Bowl. Get a guy here. Hopefully, get a serve. Right. <laughs> now, next turn, I've got to start moving forward, haven't I? It is, isn't it? It's genius, thanks to uh, BZL. Right, next turn, I'm going to have to start getting forward. But then my guy was stunned that turn. So now I've got a. I've got a man advantage this turn at least. Oh man, if I'd if I'd set up for quick snap, I would have punished him brutally. No, no, it doesn't mean that he's new to Blood Bowl, but it means that he's new to Champ Slider at least, and he has a losing record. So you know he hasn't played many games in Champ Slider with a losing record. So it's it's more information than none, isn't it? It's safe to say he isn't as good as Purple Goo, for instance. <laughs> <laughs> so uh I'm not I'm not dissing the guy. I'm not you know, I'm not being horrible or anything. But um you know or anything. Hello Vella Hoppier. It's just it's more information than zero information, isn't it? And uh and yeah, you know, if he was if that had <laughs> you know if that had returned with a you know, eight hundred games with a seventy 5% win, win rate, you'd be like, all right, we're in for a battle here. Whereas with this, you know, uh, maybe, maybe it's going to be not as difficult as it could be. I don't think he, he might not have done that. Can I play Brett? I have done before. <laughs> Yeah, not impossible. Not impossible. I didn't say it's. I said it's safe to say he's not as good as Purple Goo. I didn't, but that wouldn't not the same possible. He might. It, it may very well be Purple Goo's account. He might have just been unlucky. Um, because I tell you what, I started Champ Slider with like fucking what two, three, six or something from my first to let this season. This season, I uh, I started two, three, six or something ridiculous. So. That's probably about the same as my record in Champs Ladder this season. So, <laughs> so yeah, but it's still. Um, you know, he's, he has given up a surf there, hasn't he? And he, his, his setup, defensive setup, was open to a quick snap that I did not exploit. So. Right. I think I want to push down here, seeing as he's left it open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mm. Let's see what happens with the blitz first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can use cage here. But I do need a bunch of guys in there. That only being one guy there, they'd be hard for him to get around the backside. Um, I think I'd rather have the journeyman there because he'd have to bring in an assist to one dice him, and then you only get one dice on the blood. Yeah. Make it 
two dice potentially. Up, up, base, base, base. Up, up, base, base, base. <laughs> up, up, base, base, base. <laughs> right. Oh wow, Ducky. Well, someone even said that in chat when they said they, they, they're choosing to play that time because they know you'll be drunk. Oh man. Herp, derp, oh, base, Ducky. Base, base. This won't fail. Silly dingo. <laughs> oh man, backdoor Billy. I imagine Adan, Adan should not have played the game before his game. I'm pretty sure Adan should not have played before his playoff game. I think that was a that was a mistake because he had some bad luck in that in that match before the playoff game. And uh, oh god, yeah, he looks <laughs> he looks dejected to say the least. <laughs> oh shit pray for a dunt fucking hell and he got shot on didn't he with a, with a dice rolls you know but uh, he shouldn't have uh, he shouldn't have re-rolled that that uh, he shouldn't have re-rolled the dauntless then should he but you know, like I don't want to say, like I don't want to blame him or anything. I mean, he was under pressure, wasn't he? And uh, you know, I guess the pressure got to both people a bit. But um, I mean, the, the the one turner was horribly unlucky. There's no there's no mitigating factors there. That was just horribly unlucky. Now Norris' development, yeah, fucking hell, he looks pretty fucking dejected. Yeah, exactly, Zagini. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you, you know the any he, he got he got proper unlucky in his game before the playoffs, proper unlucky, and uh, and he he finished he finished his game in fact with a double skulls, and then he started his match against the Wood Elves with a with a uh, with a double skull. So like that's straight away it's, it's, you're already tilting off the planet then, aren't you? You know. Yeah, exactly. Rest of them. Yeah, I, I never blame anyone. Like, although, like, obviously, when I'm talking about a game, I'll point out things. I'm not really, you know, I'm not really saying this shit or anything. I can understand every misplay done when when the heat is on. Oh, huge push there! Ties up. Nobody. <laughs> Freeze me up for free. All right, that's pretty good. Um. He can block him, he can block him. Blitz, oh, he could block him, he could block him. He could blitz and get through to here, that doesn't look very good, does it? Block, 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 blitz, make a cage. That looks to be the best idea. This is a little bit trickier, all of this, I think. I'm kind of rolling for pals as well. Which is never good, is it? But. <laughs> rolling for pals. Punished. Blitz him and push him. Cram people in. Could block him. Could just stay where I am. That's probably looking the safest now, isn't it? <laughs> Still not fucking safe at all. But it's looking the safest. Should stood him up first in case of this. Fuck. 
Fuck, I should have stood that guy up. Oh boy. No oh boy. Yeah, I was thinking, you know, if I push him, <laughs> push him away, then I could dodge this guy out to there, and then he could block him. Um, but that wouldn't have worked anyway, so I should have just stood him up. And I should have known I was going to 1 in 9 and get stunned. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> he's, he's made a few stuns, but I mean, I haven't, I haven't lost anyone and hit. I surfed his guy. Just He's gummed me up pretty well, hasn't he? He's going to knock down my whole team here. Dice pal, that's how you roll pals. <laughs> yeah, okay. I should still have the, the move away over this side next turn, if unless I get pal. Hmm. That gives me the assist if he gets a pal here. He, he's he's rolled all pals. I'm not whining. I'm just pointing it out. He's made a one dice block, and so if my if I had rolled pals here, could have blitzed here and made a really good cage, but I um, did not roll pals. In fact, failed and got stunned. <laughs> But I mean, now there's a huge hole here, isn't there? So if, if, if he doesn't get the ball here, or if... Oh, baby. So now that I should be able to get forward here. Mr. Positive. All right, well, I shall cast that as well, and I think it's a guinea. More, more. That's better, isn't it? Just uh, casting that. Exactly, no whining, play better. Quit fucking whining, play better. That's it, isn't it? <laughs> it's going to be interesting, actually, it's a Guinea's game, because, uh, because yeah, obviously everyone's going to be rooting for the flings. It's, there's no offence there, is there? I mean, you can't not root for flings. Um, the, the, you know, it's going to be interesting, for sure. I mean, he's got an he's got an amazing record, hasn't he, the fling coach? You can't you can't okay, that's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. It's both both stunties. The uh the the, the halfling's like an eleven two zero or something. Oh no, another one dice pal. Um the halflings were like eleven two zero and the goblins are like nine three zero. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Um, I guess both. Yes to both, Skuro. I guess he'll be... I don't I don't know. He might not stream it because he might be trying to focus. But uh, I'll cast it. Anyway, just because it means I don't have to play good ball. <laughs> um, so I can just dodge away here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then dodge with everybody else. So he blitzes. It is absolutely incredible. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I could dodge away to shore that side up. But no, let's not. Let's not go crazy. Can he go there first? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <gasps> no, I don't want him to go there, do I? I want him to go here. And this guy goes here. Right. Well done. Phew. That was pretty scary. What do these guys do? Get punched? Mm, occupy players, maybe? Yeah, okay. Probably should have made that decision first, shouldn't I? Well, no, not really. Not really, because if I'd failed the dodge... Mm, he could have scored though, so maybe I should have stood them up first. He can occupy him. And he can go there. He 
don't try this because he's a shithead loner. Shithead loner and I don't care if he lives or dies. Well done, shithead loner. Yeah, more playoffs. More playoffs are great. It's much easier watching Blood Bowl than, than, than playing it. Uh, is yours after the guineas, Ducky? Uh, yeah, then yeah, I guess I'll do yours after. Yeah, that's that's ideal. That's ideal for me. <laughs> um, <laughs> staring at the menu, thinking about spinning for four hours. <laughs> Richard's day, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do yours as well, Ducky. Depends how Ziggy's goes. If Ziggy's is crazy, then obviously stick with Ziggy. But obviously people could go to Ziggy if they, if they wanted to watch him anyway. So, What's your game, Ducky? Uh, I know you're undead, aren't you? Who are you playing against? Which race? Dark Elves, is it? I don't know. can't remember. Norse. <laughs> oh, well, that'll be fun watching Norse lose, won't it? Hopefully. Fucking Norse. In real life, not Blood Bowl. Come on, fail one of these. Oh, he's not failing. He's not failing things. He's not failing things. Um, makes things tough, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I, th I, I, I think you'll smash him, Ducky. So, I think probably sticking with Zaginis would be more fun. Oh man, got to fail one of these. This actually doesn't help him that much because I'm still just straight up two dice and can't. Well, it adds another roll that I can fail. Hmm. He's made a lot of rolls. He hasn't failed anything. It's going to be tricky, isn't it? Oh, he has failed the least important action. He's only got one reroll, but he should reroll it, shouldn't he? Because the last turn is going to matter. He's not going to score a one turn, probably. That actually lets me get guys in there, which might be relevant. So he blocks him. He blocks him. He comes into the assist. Two dice. Done. Right. Just don't fail. Don't fail, all right? Don't fail these dice rolls. Good. Don't hover over the skull and take it by accident. Lock with him. Pull the push. That means I can't actually get round because it wasn't a pal. Can't do anything with a loner. Could shoot this blitzer. Could hit him, push him into there, into there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Could blitz for a pal <laughs> or hard dodges. Could one dice block him. One dice blitzing. I think one dice blitzing. Oh, I can dodge. And then one, and then two dice blitz. Yeah. Okay. So I have to go for the loner block now, don't I? Because it's just the same as a dodge. I 
I've moved him in the wrong square, didn't I? Fuck myself. Just fuck myself. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have moved him there. Anywhere but there. And I could have pushed him there, it just been a 2+. plus. Just, just killed myself. Completely killed myself. Not even for a playoff or anything. Just pure stupidity. <laughs> oh, that was horrible. Yeah. That was horrible moving that, that blitzer position. Oh my god. Deserved, deserved to not only fail the dodge, but also die. It was the power of positivity that got us through that. That was, that was poor play, very poor play on my part. I apologise. Apologise, Restoni. Undeserved. Undeserved touchdown there. But, never mind, eh? Well, beggars can't be choosers, Sergeant Oddity. <laughs> um, winning is all that matters, isn't it, at the end of the day? He's up to 15 now. He can get a second skill. <laughs> high risk. Yeah, it was high risk. <laughs> <laughs> it was definitely high risk. Oh man. Yeah, obviously it's not it's not ideal obviously scoring on him, but then it was obviously ideal holding it with him because he had dodge when it came to rolling dice to do things. Um these are both a touchdown away, he's a completion away. One of the linemen's a completion away. But uh you know, now that I'm one nil up, now I can think about doing other other things, can't I? <laughs> yes, try. That's true. I don't know why you would say that, but um, yeah. everything's fifty-fifty. Terrible backseat game, and no, well, scoring on the bludge player, it's it just made the drive so much easier, didn't it? You know, it was, I, I was able to get two dice blocked and have have the protection of dodge. Oh, beggars can be choosers, right? I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. Well, they can't be because he, he got fucking food, didn't he? So, uh, <laughs> um, do you know what? I was really nice one time. This, this is the nicest I've ever been, Mr. Nice. Do, do, I don't know if you remember when there was uh, rodeo burgers in, in Burger King, and I got two rodeo burgers for £2 because that was the deal. And uh, I ate one rodeo burger and I saw, a, I saw a homeless man, so I gave him my other rodeo burger. And I thought, Fucking hell, what a lovely, what a lovely fucking guy I was. And he was like, he was, you know, he was like, oh, thanks very much. And he was really nice. And I was like, I felt really good about myself. There you go. <laughs> Boxes with pockets. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Thanks, Gura. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> I don't need doubt. Oh, dear. Thanks, Astro. I was proud of myself. I felt I feel pretty, pretty happy with myself that day. And still do feel happy about it. I saw him and I thought, you know what, he, he, he could do this more than I could. I thought it was pretty, I thought it was pretty nice. Oh, fuck. I'm not going to app it, obviously. I mean, maybe I should app it if winning was all I cared about. But they, he could KO, KO in the second half, couldn't he? Um, I like how he gets the one that isn't a loner there on the KO. <laughs> Little bit. A little bit frustrating. Not mad though, not mad or whining. It's just, a, it is a touch frustrating, isn't it? When you uh, out of the three that he could have KO'd, he was the one that I cared about. <laughs> Did he really, Smoker? <laughs> that was pretty, were they, were they cheesy chips or were they just, uh, or were they just normal? Oh, I guess fries, I guess they weren't cheesy chips. Cheesy, I mean, I would cheese, steal someone cheesy chips in the world. Couldn't blame him for that. Hey, he removed himself. Power of positivity. 
Yeah! <laughs> Outrageous. Outrageous. I can't count them, but that looks like 11. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I have my save set up where I can be loaded. Uh, stupid ref. <laughs> I think he was pretty smart, actually. I, I guess I could do a proper setup. Um, I probably want to win 2 0 here, don't I? Set up like a real boy. And I guess make this side have the blood so it's both stronger and weaker. In fact, go there so there's not an unprotected player we can hit. So, exposing him, but he's blodged, so he's harder to get down, isn't he? Yeah. That seems okay. <laughs> oh, shit, squirrel dude. Yeah, Gunnarkin, yeah. Yeah, that was a hell of a good turn, wasn't it? Yeah, he made a gym foul. Silly boy. He, should, he shouldn't have tried that, should he? <laughs> I need a replay. Uh. <laughs> Dorky dude. <laughs> Let's it like you said, well, brilliant. Spin a thought. <laughs> Right, so actually, maybe I shouldn't have set up like this because it might be tricky to stop him scoring with him having the dump off. Um. <laughs> Ducky. <laughs> yeah, look, of course, any anybody. Oh, the the green screen's a bit fucked up. Yeah, all right, I'll be right back. Um. Yeah, look, anybody can win any any team, any any coach can win any game of Blood Bowl. So there's there's no easy games really, especially in the playoffs. True, isn't it though? It's like it really is true. There's no, uh, yeah, spent days about three trees in the morgue. Yeah, that's that's you know, like it, as stupid as that matchup is. Oh, fuck. as stupid as that matchup is of chores against halflings, the halflings have got a hell of a lot of strength with those four guys, and um, yeah, it's you know, if they win the toss, they can they're making four mighty blow blocks on on two or three dice. And uh, they're gonna, they're gonna, you know, they can fuck shit up, can't they? You know, so he, he, as stupid as that, goblins beat Amazons, which is insanity. So you know, um, yeah, anything can happen for sure. And and I'm never really that confident about any matchup, uh, especially in the playoffs. But like, you know, yeah, a huge head if I go like that. So I've got to do lean in. Sometimes I lean in. It, I don't know why, because I can see it fine here, but just sometimes I lean in. <laughs> Not really trying. No, it was Huanchi. Um, there was one... <laughs> there was one point where if I was him, I would have gone for a half dice on the Fnatic to chain in a mighty blow tackle hit on the ball. Um, but, you know, that wasn't. it wasn't just definitively wrong. It's just what I would have done. Um, all right, so obviously I was going for an extra hit there as well, if I, potentially an extra hit. Oh. 
I don't want him. I don't want to just stall this game, and then be scored on on turn sixteen and draw against this dude. I wanna, I wanna push it, and see what happens. Make him, make him roll some dice. I think I'd do these dodges out first to get the screen going, and then uh, if the screen is set, which it's not, I could have pushed forward with the, with the botch guy. So I think that was the right play. You know, dodge this out, get a screen here, get a screen there, then run him round. I think that was alright. Could have even gone for a dodge there or something. But you know, like a half dice on the Fnatic could have just cast the guy who made it and then I would have been like, I wish I hadn't done that. So, you know, it's just, just it doesn't really, it wasn't, it definitely wasn't a misplay that he didn't do it. Um, and there was a, you <laughs> versus goblins, oh yeah, of course, you'd be extremely confident. I would be, and I, but I've lost to goblins with uh, with my best Nurgle team before. But um, yeah, that you know, that definitely wasn't the right play when when he could have upheld the uh, upheld the Fnatic. And there was another play where he blitzed a diving tackle guy, where I would have blitzed the chainsaw instead to get two chances at the chainsaw. But you know, that's it's not it's not wrong, is it? It's just different. And the, the goblins, the hobgoblins were like made of steel. They, he didn't like remove a single hobgoblin the entire game, which was crazy. Uh, they only had one mighty blow tackle, I think. But still, it's still crazy to not remove any hob any goblins at all, isn't it? Hmm. He's made a lot of stuns this game, but I mean, he hasn't he hasn't cast anyone, so it's all right. And he's taken a cast now, hasn't he? Fenced that far, so. I do have the man advantage, and with him having a guy back with the ball, I've got a two-man advantage in the fight, so should be able to get some blocks in here and uh, put some heat on. Yeah, exactly, Gunnarkin. Anybody can make LOS blocks. Um, and I wasn't that sad because I did lose to one of the, if not, like, you know, arguably one of the best coaches. Well, not, not arguably. One of the best coaches on Fumble, arguably the best. Um... You know, and I, there was one turn where I ignored the ball a bit and I got where I paid the price. So it was fair enough. I didn't feel that bad. Yeah, yeah, goblins have a, are quite high variance. So, and especially Amazons can get murdered as well because I'm a seven. So, you know, Amazons have the, have the getting killed thing and goblins have the killing people thing. So there was definitely a chance for the goblins. Well, obviously they won, but I mean, even if they hadn't won, I would have still said there was a chance for them. Right. So safe moves first. Got the assist on these all these blocks, and then obviously make the blitz with block because it's safer. With only being a push, I'm not going to try and base him. Um, but these two guys can dodge away if these are powers. Block, please. Oh, another push. Oh, happy days. Maybe block with the wrong guy. Because it's a power push into there so that this guy can stay disconnected. Actually, maybe I should have pushed him in there. But, you know, didn't want to. Risky. I, I don't like this. I don't like this um, at all. I guess I don't need to dodge this out, but I, I uh, might as well try. Yeah. Right. I've got to put pressure on. I've got to put pressure on next turn when this guy isn't stunned. Um, and then try and force him to do some things. I, do, I don't want to draw one more. Yeah, that's true, Try yeah, the mindset is a factor as well, yeah. Wow, GFIing to block without block. Uh, justly punished. Unbelievable. Hello, Mully D. It's outrageous, wasn't it? That would have just been a push, though, if he blitzed with a block, wouldn't it? Because it would have been one and a three. But he, he used a reroll, so. Followed, he's, he's not scared of giving up blocks.
Oh yeah, it's definitely preference. I mean, it's 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 good on the pitch, isn't it? It is good. It's it's more movement seven. It's not, it's not just bad. It's not like it's not an assassin. If the runner was six three four seven, he'd be shit. <laughs> you know, but he actually brings something to the table. Yeah, blob skills. Uh, dark elves are fun, aren't they? Dark elves are fun and interactive. For sure. Which was just missed next game, uh, Jellio. <laughs> I mean, Dumb Puffet isn't, isn't that shit. It's mostly opportunity cost is what makes it bad, isn't it? No, I don't like these loners not doing things. Because they could just block him and then he could block here, but it's a bit risky with loners, isn't it? Oh man, he went for a handoff. Glorious. Glorious. He could block him. And then I could blitz him. Oh, I've really got to block with a loner. Fuck. Block with him first of all. Good. Good job that wasn't with a loner. <laughs> Christ. Um, he can go there. He's actually su survived here, hasn't he? He's actually survived with this, the, the scatter. If it had gone over here, I could have blocked there and then come around there. But now it looks like I'm going to have to what? Bring in a player here? And then one dice that way so that I can blitz this way. And then dot, run around. Like, it's not good, is it? One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm. Only having three blitzers. Not good. And can use a reroll here and then get these guys tied up. Block him. I'm, I'm not going to risk the uh, Lona blocks. Well, I'm going to Lona blitz, in fact. <laughs> oh no, I could use the other guys to blitz. So he could go one, two, three, four, five. Then he could blitz him and then go there. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the journeyman can face him. I want to do this block first. So a bit greedy this one, isn't it? Dark Elves are actually yeah, pretty slow. I meant to not follow up there so that guy would be stranding too, but never mind, it worked out alright. Kinda need the uh, knockdown here, don't I? <laughs> Bastard. Hmm. But still, I didn't use a reroll, and he's got to roll some dice to score. And then I've got plenty of time to score back. So. Hmm. Disappointing. Is this two GFIs? It looks like it to me. One GFI it is. Yeah, one GFI. So 50-50 to use a reroll. Some percent to just fail. He's gonna go for it, isn't he?
Lock out block first. Greedy guts. Could have won in. Oh, that was the one as well. <gasps> that was the one. Oh yeah, it's, he's not bad at all. I just, I just don't like him when you've got four blitzers and two witch elves. You know, you've already got two armor seven guys that you want to protect at all times. That you really want to protect because they're your best players. Um, and then you've got four blitzers that you don't want to expose. And then to add another person who's armor seven to that, I just don't like it for progression. It's only progression. But then, even then, if you had like a two K Wood Elf team, you could have a you could have a runner as well, just to like you know, as a bit of insurance against Wood Elves, or well, and any Elves in fact. Just carrying a strength six bow, yeah. Hello, little Baz. Um, yeah, I, I find if you carry with a plus a strength six bow, that's uh, pretty effective. Right, if he does the same setup, then at least I'll get to have the chance of the. Uh, the chance of the, uh, what's it called? Quick snap this time. Right. Again, I don't want to carry with this guy, but it makes it more likely to get the touchdown, doesn't it? That's the most important thing. Positivity. Okay. Don't really want to go back with it being a few turns left. This is all right, isn't it? Oh, -oh. very nice. He didn't have. Oh no, he did. He didn't have the same setup. He did. Yeah. Could blitz him, and then three plus dodge. I mean, I could have done it with. I could have put the dodge guy here and then try to do the one in nine to serve. But fuck that. Fuck that shit. I'll just fail. I'll literally just fail. There's no point. Pretty good, pretty good dice rolls so far. Um, he can go there, then he could blitz him. So maybe here. Oh, he blocks. So yeah, so here first, and then go for the uh, go for the pickle. Right, good. Don't have to re-roll it now. If I go there, then I can uh, not have to re-roll the block. Perfect. He can go there. He can go there. And now I can hit his armor seven. Glorious. Bad, not a bad turn. No. Oh, I had three rerolls, so I didn't have to go super safe that turn. Maybe I could have. Uh, so with it, if I didn't have to go super safe, I could have had a higher payoff there, couldn't I? But I think, I think going super safe is still generally good, isn't it? Where's the positivity in that phrase? Oh yeah, the mad. Um, well, the positivity is Ed the mad that I don't want to risk, take unnecessary risks. I'm positive that I can win without doing that. <laughs> I'm positive I'd fail. 
Yeah, you know, like I, I'm not going to take risk because I'm positive. I'm, I'm not just going to, you know, oh, I'll try a long bomb because it might work. You know, I'm, you know, I'm not going to do crazy moves. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> deep root mob wizard and chef is pretty damn strong. Yeah, it is. Yeah, the positivity is fuck you. <laughs> well, fuck you. <laughs> oh man, he's trying to get surfed again, or is he going to blitz that guy? Who knows? Yeah, I... Oh wow, he's left a gaping hole. Unbelievable. Look at this hole. Look at this hole he's left. Easiest touchdown of my life. And he's used his last For fuck's sake, there. Tony! Stop being wow. shit! Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, man. He is, he is forcing me to uh, potentially make a 1 in 36 risk of failure action. Right. I'm still not going to do it if I don't have to. Alright, I do, of course. Now I've got this journeyman here, all right, to make this block. I've got to think about what happens if I roll a double one, haven't I? So these two can make the cage if the dodge works. He can go, oh, he can't go there. So this guy makes the cage. He goes there if it doesn't work. I'm still pretty much fucked if it if I fail this. Phew. Alright, unfortunately being able to block these is now not on the cards unless I oh, could do a dodge and a GFI and then I could move that guy. So it's not the best cage in the world, is it? But I think it was worth it to get it. No, it wasn't, wasn't worth it to get two additional. Oh, I can reroll it, fuck it. I thought it was worth it to get two additional blocks. Oh my god, sorry about that. Oh wow, <laughs> both the additional blocks were one in nine failures. <laughs> wow, this is fucking uh, loud, that, isn't it? Sorry about how loud that is. I don't know how, oh I can, I do know how to change it. Right, I'll turn that down a bit. <sighs> All right. So yeah, it's it's not ideal, because now it's just a four plus dodging, isn't it? So you can definitely, you could definitely cage dive here. Um, but then it's a one dice on a, on a blodger, so it's not. It's not that good for him. I did get an arm brace, so it's fine, yeah. And I think it was the right play to generate two two dice blocks, you know. I think it was the right play to, to, to try that. Um I think it was. I could have I could have just gone there and been in like a Venga bus and been pretty safe, but I think it was still the right the right play. Even though I was a touch unlucky. Using the uh, using the reroll, yeah. The, the last one didn't matter, did it? Because it was the last action. Yeah, four plus six plus is pretty awful. One in twelve, and uh, fucking hell. Right. Oh, shisa. Right. 
I haven't had any problems in finding opponents for getting there. Maybe, maybe you should try restarting or something. Oh man. Oh, don't make me, don't make me roll a fucking 1 in 36 dodge again, god damn it. Determined to make the chain easier. Now, if we're bringing a player here, pow him, then he can go in there and blitz him out. So, does he dodge away at the end of the turn? Maybe. Do these move at the end of the turn? Maybe. I think making this block to see what happens first is the best. Can't follow because he needs to blitz. Oh, these are these aren't based anyway, but still better to use him because then he uses all of his movement, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Right. So block with a loner is probably not as good as dodging with him. Run away. I want to get forward, but it's not easy. To here. Stand him up. Put him in. Hope I don't roll a one in thirty six. Good. YouTube cage it. <laughs> How was that? Uh, hopefully, kill this guy. No. It sucks not keeping these base. Really should have tried to get someone on them. Maybe he's even dodged the loner. Need to make him roll dice, don't I? It, 1 in 36 to save your ball carry is terrifying, isn't it? No. We've all rolled them. Roughly 1 in 36 times. <laughs> I've got to let next turn for the Knorring threat, haven't I? I don't have to do it this turn. <laughs> no, it's just for fun. Just for fun, Zunk. They're just for fun. That's all. Just for fun. Just a bit of fun. Yeah, it was really bad, me letting them move for free. When he's got no re-rolls. <laughs> yeah, the... To be fair, the Chaos race and the Skaven race were both very good viewing, weren't they? But uh, no, I don't want to get into a stressful, a, tr a stressful race to qualify. I just want to just playing for fun. Um, there's two more Necropotents, and I might be casting them both. Uh, the Guinea is on in ten minutes, and then, uh, and then. Um, Ducky's on an hour after that. 
Going for the double six. That does actually save him from the uh, blitz there, doesn't it? I could just go this way now, actually, can't I? I was thinking of blitzing this guy to go forward, but I can go forward this way. Problem is... Is... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, GFI. Could hand it off to him. It's another roll. But I don't, I don't hate it so much. These can get blocked down anyway. So... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can just go side, side of them, couldn't I? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's not good, is it? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's good. I can run around the top here. One dice. But... Do I pass? That's the Andy Devo question, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, double GFI. Do these blocks first, and then I could just go here and not, not do anything else. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. The potential's there afterwards. Fuck it, let's go. Easy as you like. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. No, oh, double one. Fuck, shouldn't have made the dodge. Oh. Yeah, the pass was fine because I think it was fine because I was in range to just pick it up and score next to it anyway. I could only fumble it if I fumble it. Like, I couldn't do an inaccurate pass. Fumble it and it's still pretty hard to get to. Fail to catch it, it's pretty hard to get to. Unless it went that way, then that way. <laughs> he gets his pal. Stop fucking fighting everything! Ah! <laughs> that's that's pretty Fuck outrageous. Say, Tony. Stop being shit! That's <sighs> pretty outrageous. Pretty outrageous. I mean, it wasn't that outrageous, was it? It was a five plus and two two. It was. It, it would have been more outrageous if he powered the uh, if he powered the blood chain. Um, it was only five plus, not six plus. So. But it, I think I was a little bit unlucky to get powered there and him not score. It's two GFIs for him. I guess I've got to do it just one GFI, especially as the alternative is not winning. Mm. <laughs> it's just 
to one dice, isn't it? He could go there, he could two dice him, he could two dice him, he could go one, two, three, four, five, six for the two dice. That's the way to do it. Is there a better way? Maybe this one? One, two, three, four, five, six, no. No, this is the way to do it, isn't it? He blocks him. For a push. I think I have to power this guy though, don't I? Here. And then power him to there. The push is just not good enough. Got the power. Didn't hover over the skull. Pushed into the right square. Anything but a one in lots. Good. GG U2. Right. Scored. Oh, the blue screen, the good old blue screen. Oh. oh, God. Positivity. <laughs> oh, that's the clip. That needs to be a sound clip. That needs to, someone needs, whoever can make sound clips, needs to make a sound clip there, please, if that held up. Um, I'll make it a command for now, though. Positivity. Yeah, you know, I could have, I could have done well. I tried to make it a cage, but I rolled a double one. But I probably could have made it a bit safer than what I did. Um, SFC. No, it's not. No, I like, I like red and white. Um, for my blood ball teams because of the Marauders in second ed blood ball that I liked. Yes, please, Tony, if you could. If you could from that. For fuck's uh, sake, Tony! From, Stop being shit! I believe it's that one anyway. Um, do I buy this guy? No, because I want to reroll. It's a shame. It's a shame to lose star player points. But um, he's got a shit name and a reroll's better. 47 blocks. No cars, but never mind, isn't it? Oh. Poncho got uh, seven and he's already the good one. <laughs> But it doesn't matter, does it? It's, uh, a win's a win. That's the most important thing. More important than skilling players up. So, but yeah, it's a bit of a bit of a bad star player point spread at this point in time. Could go tackle before sidestep, just so I've got a tackler. I wouldn't hate having a tackler. Um, definitely going to get the third reroll. I love, I love the third reroll. I think tackle, and then the others can go blodge sidestep. Um, right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.